Oh, so clearly I've died because the game didn't pause. Oh, <laughs> all right. Uh, we cannot pause in this game. That's going to make interesting edit points. Yes. Uh, we're back. You said you were going to think on it. Uh, what if you what have you come up with? So, um, well, the Purge is a game about like society taking like it's okay to kill people. It's a movie at one point. So I got to stop you right there. Well, no, but it's about like society in the movie being able to just kill people during oh one day yeah. Of the year. I mean, it's not a game. It's just like it's population control, right? Oh, again, I haven't seen it. So yeah, it's population control. I mean, I was saying game because my mind's here. Oh, got yeah. it. Yeah, um, that was a. Freudian slip. Mm. Mm-hmm. That's what they call it in the Freudian psychology slip. Gee, business. But I don't love my mother. So, well, I, I do love Oedipus. my mother. But that's well, no. Freud, Freud. Freud thinks that like everybody has a desire to be inside of their mother. Isn't that the Oedipus complex? That is an Oedipus complex. Well, an Oedipus complex is when you when you when you do it. Love your mother. <laughs> yeah, like that. Um, but Freud just thinks everybody wants to do their mom and their dad. Like everybody has an Oedipus and an Electra complex. Right. Everyone has to beat the Dark Army uh, um, in I the th- Marvel Universe. Yes. And wear a skin-tight costume and have a not very good movie. The Electra Complex? That We're on the same page man, here, right? No, not at all. No, I was what? lost it okay, so much. Okay, Electra is a Marvel character. Uh, Fair. Played by Jennifer Garner. Mm. The lovely Who's Jennifer, Jennifer Garner? Garner? Jennifer Garner is Kidding. the one. Kidding. I know Jennifer Garner. She's got that face that's Play like Electra. slight. She's like a more attractive Sarah Jessica Parker. What you just said <laughs> does not narrow anything down for me. Because a more attractive Sarah Jessica Parker, uh, we're looking at her. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but like as far as. Oh, that was. Oh, he that came back around. That killed me. That was. That immediately killed me. Wow. You don't want to get hit by that. No. Is what you're saying. Not at all. And I keep on forgetting to open a short, shortcut up. A shortcut up? A short cup up. A short cup up. Which is just, it's, it's, uh, that's just a measuring scale for, um, very small amount of liquid. A short cup up. A, a short? Yeah. Cup up. Um, I would like a short cup up of wine. Oh. I've yeah. got that right here for you, sir. Thank you. <laughs> it's a Merlot. 1968. Boy, that Adam Ruins Everything. Shout out to Adam Ruins Everything. Uh, <laughs> great, great series. I watched them all. Uh, and I just watched the wine one. Um, and uh, where they're like, oh, yeah, w- wine connoisseurs, what, sommeliers? Oh, I remember that uh, episode. Yeah, they're like, they actually don't do anything. They do the exact same shit that you do. It's just a matter of taste for so like a $5 wine and a $200 wine. There's, like, no difference because there's a bunch of blind test studies that they did. Um, and I thought that was really cool as someone who does not drink wine and generally hates people who are insufferable. <laughs> and yet I'm here. Yeah. Well, you have the PS4. <laughs> <laughs> and oh, Taylor was working. Fair. Wow. <laughs> Man. That. I feel just as jaundiced as he is right now. <laughs> I mean, he looks pretty good. Well, now he's, he's just covered slick. in red. Yeah. Well, except oh. for the front. <laughs> <laughs> so because he's supposed to be wearing a shirt? No, that wouldn't. This is... No, no. Actually, this is just the splatter of how... Did you... Oh, were you just like, your back was turned? I, maybe. Oh, I don't remember. God, I love games. I remember reading... Look it was those some pants. He looks like right out of the front of any death metal album. It was some dead or alive game where they were like, yeah, you can like focus your attacks on certain things and it like makes a difference and this was before like headshots like you just shot somebody and it counted like as a headshot and you were like oh you shoot someone in the foot and they're like oh the pain uh <laughs> that's usually how that ends true. up happening um but it didn't matter whether you shot them in the brain or you shot them in the foot they took the same amount of damage and then I remember reading it was in a Game Informer magazine. Oh, my. Uh, oh, my. I'm yes. really dating myself. Although I guess that's still out, what? technically. What? I remember dating myself? Is that just what you just said? I like to go uh, out to a bar, get a, uh, a quick cup up of wine. Okay. No. With myself. Yeah. Mirror in front of me. Uh, the wait staff is very polite because they see the mirror. They see and it's just me. And they think, man, this my guy may kill me at some point. They Yeah. This... if. I don't serve this guy well. This is the end for me. <laughs> he will absolutely be in the alley waiting. 
uh, with a broken mirror. <laughs> <laughs> if I can't love me, then no one will. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, Game Informer, fantastic! What a great thought. Wait, you had did not me. finish that. So oh, you actually? Well, just, it was. It was great. You sat there. Did you actually have a mirror? <laughs> That's the that's the point you want to go back to. Yes, <laughs> not the real point. No, I did. I absolutely had a mirror. You... It was set up in front of me. I put a mustache on the mirror, <laughs> so it was just enough. It was like, oh, I know that's me, but I don't have a mustache, so <laughs> it can't be fully me. Uh, I gotta say the most, the the best part about it is when you cheers, because it's so it's perfect. <laughs> on the... Perfect like, hey, every that's time. That's for you. Everything else, I was, I was like, please don't watch me eat, and then I'm like, okay, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. <laughs> uh, it was weird from there, and I don't know about you, but I can't order the same thing as somebody else. <laughs> so there were a lot of problems right off the bat. I didn't see him again. If you were wondering, I was wondering. I was wondering, like, did you get lucky though? Um, well, as you recall, I was waiting in the uh, in the alley with a broken mirror. Oh, that so actually So the night ended too. quickly okay, after that. Okay, that's fair. Um, uh, so you're, you're not going to make it out of here alive. Uh, you have no clue my what I'm capable of. I have a cane. That's true. Oh, shit, here comes that cane. And Abel. Um, well, I am Abel, and this is a cane, and this is a biblical reference. Did you know that there was a huge uh, massacre of animals, a slaughter... A ritual, is a that ritualistic what Noah's slaughter. Ark is about? Uh, this is this is real news. So I'm oh, gonna give okay. you the real news. Oh man, there this was there's some country. Uh, very recently, it it was to celebrate Cain and Abel, how like uh, God was kind of a dick and was like, hey, go kill your son, and then like he was just about to do it, and then he was like, oh, I can't believe you, you know, almost fucking did that. Cain and Abel were brothers. <laughs> <laughs> You do know that, right? I, I do, and thank you for bringing it back to Budborn. Uh, <laughs> no, just hanging out and, with your brother. Um, but 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 actually, though, they were brothers. Yeah. And what? and okay. that that you were talking about killing your son, which is uh, a different thing in the Bible. Oh, Cain and Abel. You're right. I'm sorry about yeah, that. Yeah, I'm uh, trying to focus Cain, Cain more on what you were brothers. Yeah, and that's it. The dad. I don't remember the dad's name now. Um, he had to kill one of his sons. Is this the right story? I think I Wait, think no, no, you're no, I think this is Abraham. Slight. Yes. Ab who was Abraham's son? Uh Abraham's son was uh Abra Baloney. Um <laughs> right. I can't okay, remember yeah, yeah. his name. No, it was Abra Baloney. Yeah. Um so he has to go out there and kill Abra Baloney. Uh and because God said so. Because, you know Which is natural, yeah. Yeah, if God was I drunk. Mean, if God says like, it, hey, yeah, 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 hey, go I think this is a family guy joke, so I won't do it. Um <laughs> He was drunk, being the entire joke, so I oh, won't make oh, it. Oh, okay. Um, well, I mean, I, naturally, I just think God is just always sort of drunk. I mean, how can you be so alone and not be drunk all the time? Boy. You know, he doesn't have a significant other. That's that's so true. I, I feel for him a lot now. Yeah, exactly. And like he's his own son, too. He's like exactly. the father, the he was son, so and alone. the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit, made... it's right in there. Yeah. He's drunk. He's drinking the Holy oh Spirit. Oh, my gosh. We that's put it. put it all together. No one has made this connection. Uh, we are we are gods among men. We are, yeah, no, we're actually prophets at this point. We sure are. Just and we're speaking, making prophets. speaking from the heart of God. That guy's just using a brick. Yeah, no, I he's. Love that. I don't know where he got it from because if you've noticed, all of the bricks are actually in place. Like, oh, hello. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that was just really rude. So I whipped him. See you later. Yeah, he liked it. He sure did. That's why he had some white mist come out of him. It's naturally what happens when I whip people. So they had this ritual for the Abraham and Abra Baloney. Uh, okay, yeah, no, well, way they, off they, topic. They slaughtered Man. a shitload of sheep, and they slaughtered so much that the uh, streets ran red with blood. Not, Ooh, not does figuratively, biblically ran red with blood as they like hosed down all the blood off these streets. Wow, that's uh, a lot of sheep. That's a lot of sheep. But that's right. I, I remember reading it. and I was like, that's absolutely horrible. 
And then I read further, and they were like, oh, and they, they slaughtered all these sheep that they had, and then they gave the uh, food to the poor and the homeless. Oh, that's fair. And I'm like, I, oh, okay, well, that's that's all right. Yeah, it's like a kind thing almost. Yeah. So on that day, which was a couple days ago, uh, we we honor Abrabloni and his meaty goodness of Abrabalona. <laughs> Baloney. <laughs> I guess the joke was already so, there, but <laughs> so you're, what we're saying is Oscar Mayer, all the way. Oscar Mayer killed a lot of sheep. That's actually what happened, isn't it? That's yeah. Oscar Mayer is the cause of millions of sheep's death. Actually, is it? I don't know what's in bologna. I don't either. I feel I don't. I didn't get fed much bologna. Do you have a lot of bologna? Were you poor as a child? <laughs> <laughs> so as a child, I don't. I, I had a habit of hitting my head against my lunchbox, which was an igloo lunchbox. It was no light affair. It was a heavy hit. It was like a big thud. I think I was starved for attention, but I don't remember. I can't say I, so I this, know what was inside of the lunchbox. Is this in school? Yes. You would just take your lunchbox and, and just slam think, it against your head? You'd think a teacher would be like, oh, this child is needy. Like, he needs something. Maybe a fond touch on the shoulder. Maybe just a, hey, are you lonely? Anything. But no, I continued to hit my head against this lunchbox. <laughs> I mean, if I see someone doing that now, and it's probably because I'm not a good person, but I'm like, I can get the fuck out of here. <laughs> That's if, fair. If nobody else comes up, someone's going to look over at me and like, are you going to do something? The thing is, or what? it's actually the reason I was like, decently gained popularity in elementary school. Like, people are like, oh, that's the kid that hits his head against the lunchbox. What a cool fellow. Because <laughs> everybody uses the word fellow in elementary school. How, how far did that follow you? Um, at elementary school. Just elementary school. Oh, okay. I, was known, I was known more for my height rather than the lunchbox hitting. Because um, everybody knows height is what causes every elementary schooler to be famous. Hey, well, America famous, is, that is. Uh, is set up for the the height all right next time <laughs> on buttborn yes. we're gonna keep playing buttborn uh and that's gonna be good just just run around yep. since we can't pause